Unataka kuzeka? Hamtaka kuzeka? Tizameni video. Hapo msisahau kusubscribe, sawa? Hi my loves, how are you guys? Oh, I'm back again with another video. It's been a while since I've uh, filmed, sit down and filmed. The last video I posted is pre-recorded. So I'm so excited. I was away, I was in Zanzibar, I was enjoying, I went to a wedding, I did people's makeup, it was fun. Now I'm back and I'm ready for another video. If you don't know me, my name is Saifa, S-A-I-F-A also known as cypher beauty here on youtube and on instagram oh my god while i'm talking i realize this is a swahili video Quayo, we're gonna change it up real quick habari you mean saifa and you kind of put another saifa when you up a youtube not saifa beauty up a youtube not instagram i hope uh, when i follow kote kote please follow here subscribe to my channel if you want to learn more about beauty tips spf skincare, makeup, reviews, and all those good stuff. So if you are interested in such stuff, then don't forget to subscribe down below, the red button, and kizungu. Oh my god. And ring the bell. Hi, the video is in Swahili, so video in Swahili. Oh my god. Hi. Sasa leo tulikuwa tunataka kuongelea tena habari ya SPF. Video yangu ya mwisho mlipenda. Thank you guys. Mlipenda na mlikuwa mnanipa more questions and uh, feedback nzuri. Afu nilikwambia ni kama kuna mambo mengi tunaweza kuongelea kwenye SPF kama mnataka nitawaletea videos. Yes. Sasa leo nimeamua ku tackle a few questions. Maswali kidogo so yote bado tuna mengi ya kuongelea kwenye SPF na sitaongea hapa yote kwa sababu kuna vitu vingi kama application vipi ku apply kama nataka nione ninapo apply yani kabla ya makeup au siku ilikuwa sipaki makeup vitu hivyo vinakuwa vina change of course uh, day to day lakini uh, tutaongelea kidogo leo pia okay msijali lakini nitakuwa sionyeshi demo kama mnaponiona kama mna demo leo hapa kama mko interested kujua kuhusu uh, types of SPF maana yake nini zile SPF 30 SPF 50 SPF 100 tofauti yake nini ipi upake wewe mwenyewe binafsi kwa skin yako wewe endelea kutizama hii video if you're interested let's get started leo nimeandika points points kamili ili nisisahau wala nisiz sambai sambai kila pahali kwa hiyo tutaongelea points that's the plan let's make it happen so i wrote notes and that's still not everything you know spf is nice science is nice and i love science so i love spf anyways uh first thing we're going to be talking about is spf what does spf mean spf it means sun protecting factor SPF sun protecting factor so basically it just protects your skin from the sun okay and we talked about it last time what the SPF number means on a bottle such as this one the SPF number is right here SPF 40 it's just blocking your sun against UVB rays we talked about it last time there's two types of rays UVA and UVB these are different okay so the spf number actually just refers to oh i'm speaking in english i'm failing already sasa tuendele kuiswahili spf number manake ni ina protect against the sun na ni ina protect against ile uvb rays tuliongelea kuna uva na kuna uvb uva Haipo kwenye ile sunscreen number, UVB ndo ile SPF 40, SPF 50, SPF unaondeka kwenye ile bottle. Sawa? UVA rays, UVB rays kama mimi kwa pandani madirisha yamefungwa. Si si pati sunburn, si pati cancer, si pati chochote because UVB haiwezi kuingia ndani ya madirisha. Okay? Okay, kwa ndani you are protected against UVB rays. They are slower energy, they are less energetic compared to UVA. UVA penetrates through the window so if i'm sitting here thinking i'm protected by the windows and the walls i'm not i'm still aging i'm still getting hyperpigmentation english next word leo inavonekana so lingine ni kwamba watu wanaona ile spf 15 spf 30 spf 40 spf 
50. Ini nampak ke SPF 100. Betul ni nampak macam, oh, memang pada SPF 100. That means Nico protected Vizuri. Yes, Nico protected more than people with SPF 50. I found the real deal. Mimi Nico said, no, 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 no. Kwanza, you're never 100% protected. You're not 100% protected. Never. Okay. Pili, UVA rays, ndo zinazofanya uzeke na upati zile hyperpigmentation. Uzuri, okay, kuzeka haraka kwa sabi ya jua. UVA rays zina penetrate kwenye windows, zina ingia kwenye skin, zina penetrate kwenye skin, zina smash the cells. When the, sm when the cells are smashed and broken, that's where you get hyperpigmentation and you also get aging, okay? So that's all caused by UVA rays. Sasa kwa nini mtauliza kwa nini sasa ile SPF number pale inaongelea tu kuhusu UVB rays? Niliongelea sijui hii zamani ni kwamba zamani watu scientists scientists may evolve, eh? science may evolve. Zamani watu walikuwa hawajui kwamba UVA rays ni mbaya kuliko UVB rays. Kwa hiyo walikuwa wanatengeneza zile sunscreen just for UVB rays. Ndio maana imeandikwa ile SPF number just for UVB rays. And then scientists you know, we keep exploring things all day, every day. Or I love to make you go UVA rays, UVA rays, ni mbaya zaidi kuliko UVB rays. Kwa hapo ndo kwamba sasa wanaingiza ile uh, sign. Niliongelea pia kwenye, kwenye SPF utakuta ile round up ndani yake mendikuwa UVA. Lazma utizame kama imendikuwa ile sign. Chapili ni kwamba pia inandikuwa plus, P, no, inandikuwa PA plus plus. If SPF imeandikwa PA plus plus, manake pia it is against UVA rays. Okay? So there's two signs. The circle over UVA and also PA plus plus. Nsisa ukustizama. An example, nikomba hii hapa. Umona hapa chini? SPF 40. Na hapa chini? PA PA plus plus. That means this SPF is good for UVA rays too. Kwa hiyo swali lingine ni kwamba okay kama SPF namba hii inaongelea ni UVB tunajuaje kuna how much UVA inside yani UVA protection inside the SPF kila kila countries ina law zake tofauti but countries nyingi wanakuwa wanaweka uh, 1 over 3 one third, one third of the SPF protection is actually UVA protection okay kwa SPF 50 one third of it is UVA Two thirds is UVB. Uh, kila nchi ina tafauti ya zile numbers na wanabuandika pia. Sasa tutizame zile number kabisa, number SPF 30, SPF 50, SPF 60, SPF 100. Tafauti ya kinini. Easy numbers ni actual mathematics, okay? Ni science. It's not that if you are SPF 30, SPF 40, SPF 50 zinaenda hivi. It's not a linear curve, okay? It's actually an exponential curve. Let me show you guys. Let me try and show you. SPF is not like this. It's not like happen 15, happen 20, happen 30, happen 50. It's not like that. Okay? It's not like that. SPF, actually, this is mathematics. It's a linear curve. Okay? So, as I was saying, Nikonachasema, SPF, CO linear curve, ni exponential curve. Kwamba, SPF 15, SPF 20, SPF 30, SPF 60. Ukitizama SPF 30 na SPF 60, haiko times 2, okay? It's not times 2. It's not like you're getting twice times 2 protection. Unapata just 1% more SPF when it comes to SPF 30. And SPF 60. So now SPF 30 is minus 97% and SPF 60 is minus 98%. Why it's not double. It's just 1%. Now from SPF 30 to SPF 50, it's less than 1%. Okay? Kwa msione kama mepata ile number kubwa ndo itakuwa una protection kubwa zaidi. No, 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 no. Mathematics does not work that way. SPF does not work that way. Okay? So if you see companies saying we have SPF 100, they're just messing with you. It's not that big of a difference. Well, what's important to know is that you should go uh, from SPF 30 above, okay? Don't go to SPF 15. It's quite low difference. in only kind of have 93%, 97%. Difference 
is there okay so it's pf 15 mm -mm. but it's pf 30 50 great you don't need to go more than that you don't need to go to 60 you don't need to go to 100 there's no difference it's just marketing okay they're trying to get you fool you confuse you okay okay then we're going to be talking about the difference between uh physical sunscreen and chemical sunscreen i'm not going to stay here so long chemical sunscreen and physical sunscreen from the mrefsana kwa sababu previous video inaongelea vizuri kuhusu mambo hayo and you can take a link chini kama hujaona ile previous video wende kutizama kwa sababu kule nitakuwa nimeongelea zaidi kuhusu physical and, and uh, chemical sunscreen lakini nataka kuwakumbusha tena msiogope neno chemical chemical ni dunia nzima dunia nzima imetengenezwa physics and chemistry bila physics na chemistry hakuna dunia Okay, msiogope kuona jina chemical. Lakini tukiona tofauti za physical and chemical sunscreen ni kwamba physical sunscreen inakaa ni juu. Okay? Ikishakaa juu inakuwa kama ni protective layer on top of your skin. Sun rays zinakuja, zinakuwa reflected away. We talked about this. When it comes to chemical sunscreen, inaingia ndani ya ngozi vizuri. Okay? Alafu zile sun rays zinakuja, zinaingia ndani ya skin lakini kwa sababu ya ile physical chemical sunscreen zinakuwa zinakosa nguvu zake zote mpaka zikifika huko kwenye cells haina nguvu tena hai damage your skin hai damage hai kupi aging hai kupi pigmentation that's the difference that's the big difference tatizo ni kwamba physical sunscreen zinakuwa ni nyeupe titanium dioxide kama ile ni nyeupe sana kwa hiyo many people hawawezi kuvaa au wakavaa bila makeup unajua kama u mimi nikipaka zile nyeupe sana naona lazima nipake makeup ili nipunguze ule weupe kwa sababu unatisha in general unatisha lakini zipo physical sunscreen kama wewe mwenyewe unapenda physical sunscreen kwa watu wengine wanasema oh, Mr. kuingiza rays ndani ya ngozi yangu people prefer different things okay kama wewe una prefer physical sunscreen unaweza kutafuta wanatia wana squeeze physical sunscreen lakini wanazingiza pigmentation wanazingiza rangi kwa hiyo zinaweza kuwa kama your color or something like that i know kama kwenye company here by a super group company here by a super group specifically najua kama wana wana sunscreen zilokuwa chemical sunscreens lakini zina pigmentation kidogo kwa hiyo zinakuwa kama rangi ya skin yako kama you prefer that you can go for that otherwise zinakuwa zinaleta ile rangi nyeupe which is not flattering which is not good lakini nataka kuongelea vingine ni kwamba ziko sunscreens zilokuwa ziko mixed chemical and physical that's actually the best the best uh, sunscreen because you are also reflecting if some goes in you are also breaking down kwa hiyo two best of both worlds that's good you can look for something like that so lengine ile nilikuwa nataka kuongelea ni kwamba what sunscreen should i use mimi hapa mimi hapa peke yangu nataka kujua what sunscreen unaona wewe mimi nitumie sasa nataka kuongelea kama ni wewe ni mtu wa oily skin na uko prone to mapele unapata ile wekundu kitoka tu nje unajiona wewe mwenyewe unajiona kuna watu walokuwa na rosacea wana pimples wana acne wana ile redness ya skin if you see skin yako iko hivyo make sure usitumie heavy cream sunscreen kuna zile creams heavy cream stay away from those leave them alone leave them for the dry people okay dry people can use that you can't kwa sababu remember sunscreen pia zinatoa pimples nyingi okay depending on your skin type kwa wewe kama wewe una mafuta and you are nini unatafuta sunscreen zilokuwa ziko kama lotion lotion runny okay liquidish zimejatele uh, zingine ni kama gel kama hii hapa hii hapa anatumia my sister hii hapa ni very good for her skin kwa sababu ngozi yake ngozi yake ni very acne prone hata uione hii ni kama gel gone very dry imeka kama hata inakupa kama hiyo mat inakufanya hata ngozi yako ionekane mat okay unaona hata huioni hii ni nzuri sana kwa watu walokuwa wana acne prone skin kwa msitumie zile heavy creams kabisa 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 kuna watu wengine wanaona ni vizuri zaidi kutumia sprays sprays sunscreen the yeah, sprays is is hardly ever enough Okay, wewe hutachukua ile spray, uka spray mara moja ndio usha spray kila pale ukaona umepata sunscreen, hujapata. Okay? Ile namba ya sunscreen kwenye 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 chupa yake utakuwa wewe hujapata. Ukiapply sunscreen kidogo, hata kama chupa imesema SPF 50, ukiapply kidogo hujapata SPF 50. Okay? Nikichukua hii nimechukua mm, nyingi. Ha. Lakini nimekichukua kama hii hapa ndo nimejipaka hapa 
Hii mimi hapa sijapata sunscreen SPF 50, okay? This is not SPF 50. I am not using it correctly. Kwa hiyo when it comes to sprays, unless you're going to spray yourself 10 times, push, 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 10 times or more utakuwa hujapata SPF 50. Na pia ukishaanza ku spray hiyo mara 10, mara 11, mara 15 on your face, itaisha haraka, it's just a waste of money. So I do not recommend people to buy sunscreen when you spray, okay? Unless you're spraying your body and you really like you you you're going on a trip, maybe you're going swimming or something and you want something you can just easily spray on all the time, it will finish in like a few days, maybe 4 days if you're going on a vacation. That's how little you get in there so just just don't bother with sprays okay kwa sababu sunscreen unatakiwa kupaka sunscreen unatakiwa kupaka sunscreen 2 ml per centimeter hiyo ni kama nusu kijiko cha chai nusu kijiko cha chai kwa hiyo what you need for your face au unaweza kuweka kwenye kidole chako kama vidole viwili ingie kama vidole viwili that's how much sunscreen you need for your face it's a lot of sunscreen okay that's a lot of sunscreen that you need on your face so be careful remember how much sunscreen you need because then it won't be beneficial to you and you won't get them out i hate the sunscreen that i'm using that's why i'm wasting it because this really does not work on my skin once it's so fragranced can't even breathe who are not good for my acne skin and really it's quite heavy and quite oily so also not good for my oily skin it stinks yeah my husband loves it my husband has dry skin not problematic who i can't even talk with this near my face not problematic he doesn't get acne so he loves this and he can use this and it makes him moisturized makeup <laughs> kwa spf 15 was spf 15 not enough really Umeona ile sunscreen nilotumia? Utapaka makeup yote hiyo. Utapaka foundation yote hiyo kwenye uso wako. Utahitaji foundation nyingi kupata hiyo foundation. Hiyo SPF inaandikwa kwenye chupa. Kwanza you be wasting your foundation. Foundation is not cheap. Sawa? Na pili, hard for you to put all that on. Na when it comes to powder pia, ikisema powder ina SPF, utapaka powder. How much powder are you going to put on your face for you upate hiyo protection? You can't, okay? You just can't. So do not rely on makeup products that have SPF because you're not going to use enough SPF. Put away the kutumia SPF ya kutosha kama una rely only on makeup products. Lakini mimi si mind kama nishapaka SPF yangu, nishapaka cream yangu, alafu nimepaka na makeup pia ina SPF. I don't mind that, but I'm not going to use ile product just for the SPF. It's not going to work. Tumemaliza leo topics za leo. I hope you guys will enjoy this and I hope it's helpful. Lakini I wanted to us to do a summary kidogo ya ku explain kila kitu. First things first, remember to look for SPF 30, 50, anything above that. I know haya, okay? It job ili asubuhi kabla hujapaka makeup. Kama una oily skin, paka um mimi napaka kama serum, paka serum nyepesi. Okay, serum nyepesi ya antioxidants kwa kama vitamin C nzuri sana especially vitamin C ukipaka na SPF they work together so well to protect your skin. Sawa, so, kwa utafuteni kama make, kama serum nyepesi ya, ya ya vitamin C, alafu on top of that put your sunscreen. Sunscreen is very moisturizing, okay? You don't even need moisturizer in the morning kama una good SPF which is very moisturizing for your skin. This is for people with uh, oily skin. You don't need to pile up products. You don't need more and more and more. Oh, come on, you have a serum and a sunscreen, you're good to go, put the makeup on top, okay? But if you have dry skin, you can add in moisturizer and then sunscreen with the vitamin C. Vitamin C is very good in the morning, okay? reapply sunscreen, you can use the sprays. Sprays are very good for reapplication because you are wearing makeup, it's hard for you to reapply sunscreen on top of that me uhondo napata shida hiyo lakini kama una spray spray is good way to just keep reapplying get a little bit of protection but do not use it as the first sunscreen okay kwa pia kuna zile uh, sunscreen za kwenye stick i don't have any of those zile zile ni nzuri pia kwa kutumia under your eyes msisa huko apply sunscreen under your eyes okay it's one of the most important places wapi tunapata wrinkles chini ya macho kwa zile za stick very good for specific areas under your eyes on your lips 
okay those are best for that and see come on acne prone skin do not use those sticks all over your face because some of those sticks are very sticky and heavy and greasy you don't want to put them on top of areas that you get uh, pimples people don't get uh, pimples under their eyes so it's safe for you to use there so just use them in places where you know you don't get oily or you don't get any pimples very good for reapplication during the day for specific areas make sure you concentrate I can get a very good amount of SPF under your eyes okay and that's it my loves I hope uh, I've answered ah to my Maliza I hope I hope kuhusu uh, sunscreen najua kuna mambo mengi mengine ya kuongelea na mimi niko hapa hapa kwa ajili yenu kwa hiyo kama mnataka kuongelea mambo mengine nyie niambieni mimi niko hapa sawa najipaka sunscreen kwa miguu sorry okay niko hapa kwa ajili yenu kwa niulizeni kuna ndio hizo topics nyingi nataka tu pia kuongelea kwenye when it comes to sunscreen sitaki video iwe ndefu najua mara iliyopita mnemeniambia kama video ikiwa very informative mnakuwa hamboeki lakini pia video sitaki iwe ndefu sana kwa sababu hata kuiupload na kwa shida nimeona bora nisifanye fupi fupi nitaeka playlist okay nitaeka playlist ya sunscreen tutakuwa tunaongelea everything when it comes to sunscreen nitawaonyesheni pia uh, how na napaka sunscreen in the morning how napaka sunscreen to reapply how uh, nitawaonyesheni yani ndio application how much i actually put on my face that's very important. Msiogope msi, msi sunscreen. Najua ni ghali. Watu wengine wanasema oh ghali sana mimi siki nyingi. Lakini haikusaidii. Kwa hiyo unafanya nini? Unanua ya nini kama hutaki kusaidie? Ndio ni expensive, lakini it's very worth it for your skin. Hatutaki kuzeeka, hatutaki pigmentation. Zisio zinokuja bila kabla ya time yake. Please no, please. Okay? That's it for me and my loves. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to press the like button so that I know you like this video. So if you press like, I will know. Don't forget to comment below and let me know your thoughts on SPF. And uh, till next time, my loves. Bye-bye.